Phylum Annelida Phylum Annelida consists of both free-living and parasitic segmented worms. Their body is long, cylindrical or flattened. They are bilaterally symmetrical and triploblastic animals. A true coelom or body cavity is seen in these animals for the first time. Their body wall possesses chitinous setae for locomotion. Body is divided into numerous segments. The external segments are exactly equal to internal segments. Such type of arrangement of segments is called metamorism. In some animals like the leech, setae are absent, but a body wall and posterior sucker helps in locomotion. A well-developed closed circulatory system in these animals is seen for the first time. Hemoglobin is not in the blood cells but is dissolved in the plasma. Specialized respiratory organs are absent in organisms of this phylum. Respiration occurs by diffusion of gases through capillaries in moist skin. The alimentary canal is a straight cylindrical tube running along the length of its body. Located at its anterior end is the mouth, which opens into the buccal cavity. The alimentary canal opens outside by a small circular aperture called anus. The digestive system in these animals is thus complete. They possess coiled tubular nephridia for excretion. These are arranged segment-wise and open into the intestine. The central nervous system consists of paired ganglia, nerve cord and nerves. Each ganglion is a mass of nerve cells arranged segment-wise. The nerve cord is located in the third and fourth segments, bifurcates to encircle the pharynx laterally and then unites dorsally to form a nerve ring. The nerve ring along with cerebral ganglia forms the brain. These animals are devoid of a skeletal system. Coelomic fluid acts as hydrostatic skeleton. The pressure of fluid along with action of the muscles provides support to the body. Coelom with surrounding muscles is known as hydrostatic skeleton. They are bisexual or unisexual animals. They reproduce sexually by cross-fertilization.